Yo, what's going on guys? My name is Chris Garcia, aka Crypto Godson. Today, uh, I just wanted to talk. Honestly, I'm driving. I just picked up some food from my wife and I, some uh, bowl of shrimp and crawfish. Anyways, what I'm, I'm thinking about, you know, my brain is just turning here. I think it's essential and it's very important that I get this information out. That only is important and um, it's for a worthy cause, but uh, it's timely. So on September 7th, we, the reserve community, aka RSR, that you may see, you know, on Twitter, the hashtag RSR. Anyways, we're going to be pushing a cause. We're going to be running a campaign to declare access to stable currency as a human right. So the same way we have access to, you know, water and um, people in the U.S., I mean, it's not declared a human right, but like electricity and um, Internet access are like essentials, right? But the UN, the United Nations, has previously declared water as a human right. <clears throat> And if you are involved in crypto finance or in the economy in any type of way, you may have heard of the hyperinflationary countries such as Argentina, Venezuela, uh, Zimbabwe, uh, and Lebanon. Um, long story short, people in these countries, even if you're rich, not to mention if you're a regular person, but even if you're rich, they've seen their life savings like dwindle down to, I'm not sure of the exact percentage, but I know it's less than 10% of what it used to be. And that's probably a, a long shot, that's probably high. But um, yeah, just think about if you were a millionaire in the US, you moved to Lebanon or whatever, and you, you switch all your currency to the Lebanese currency, and you just see your millions go to, you know, under a thousand dollars or under, you know, $10,000. Like, it's mind blowing, right? It's hard for them to even, like you don't have your dignity anymore at that point because all your time, energy, your work, you know, what you wake up every day to do, it's being stored in this form of currency, obviously to pay bills, put food on the table, but also for those that want to save and provide for their generations to come, they can't do it anymore because their currency is devaluing. So if you, you know, if somebody has the same skill set, um, the same intellectual ability, and they were just born in different geographical regions there's a clear there's going to be a clear correlation between those that outperform because they have access to a stable currency versus those that don't and that's the premise of this whole cause and um so be looking out for september 7th and if you want to be a part of it please reach out to me in the comments below um obviously you can dm me on any social media at crypto godson um instagram twitter primarily also telegram join the telegram group below as well but um, we're trying to meet. So there's actually a meeting that's going to be held on August 17th. So Reserve Protocol, is, you know, it's open invitation for a Zoom call to basically get to know what the campaign is all about. Not only that, but um, to, you know, put your ideas forth. And um, we have a, a WhatsApp channel. And then we also have another page that we're working on. But primarily, we, we're brainstorming. And we also have a, a Twitter Spaces um, led by the community on um, so it's going to be 5 p.m. Eastern time this Sunday So, you know today's Friday. I'm talking about Sunday. So what is that? I don't even know the day It doesn't matter but this Sunday, you know what today is this Sunday 5 p.m. Eastern Twitter spaces will be held on um, focused on this campaign and um, so you're if you're interested You don't even have to be a reserve holder. I want to make sure that's clear this um, It's not just for people that support reserve It's people that believe that access to a stable currency should be a human right. So regardless if you're supporting another stable coin project or another crypto project or not even investing in crypto at all, you can be a part of this. And that's really why I feel like this is much more important than anything I've ever posted on this channel because it's outside of the whole crypto world. Mainly everything I talked about is in the crypto world. This is like based, based on human rights, you know, human dignity, human freedom, you know, and these are things that should be you know obviously we should have equal rights and with respect to stable currency water things like that regardless of where you're born and so this is more of a human humanitarian effort this is about the people not the currency not the profit the people not the profit you feel me so if you understand that please get at me please talk to me and um also just a caveat if you're if you're a rsr holder RSR will be featured on Bloomberg this coming Thursday, I believe. I believe actually it's going to be either Tuesday or Thursday this coming week, regardless. Bloomberg for in the Latin American Latin American 
Bloomberg sector, like not the main Bloomberg in the U.S., but there's another Bloomberg that's focused on Latin America. Our star is going to be featured, so that's going to be huge. I can't wait for that. And then also, I believe it's going to be August 17th. If you're in the L.A. area, there's going to be a reserve-focused L.A. meetup. Um, I haven't received the invitation, but if you're interested, I can forward you to the guy on um, Telegram so you can talk to to potentially get an invite. So um, without further ado, thank you guys for tuning in. If you're interested, like I said, get at me ASAP. Let's stay healthy and get wealthy.